2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. What's up? This is Roman Fritz, IFBB Pro for ProjectBodybuilding.com on my very first ever Q&A video. I mean ever, okay? Not even on the site, ever. Before I start, I gotta put a disclaimer. So this is my Q&A video, okay? You're asking my opinions and you're asking, you know, my advice or whatever. So, if you don't agree or if you don't like what I'm saying, just turn it off. If you feel tempted to write a comment below that you don't agree or that you're of a different opinion, we don't give a fuck. The first question is by Guru Hansa. Uh, who's more popular in bodybuilding circles in Germany? Jason Genova or Dave Palumbo? <coughs> I think people over here don't even know who Jason Genova is, so it's definitely Dave. Next question. By Mr. Matt Mindrod, is it true that animal videos are actually shot, are not shot in black and white, but instead all of the animal athletes are just very pale skin? Well, they are shot in black and white, but we are all... No, actually, Frank is pretty brownie and <laughs> is pretty dark. And, yeah, but I'm pale as a ghost. I wouldn't necessarily say that I train him more often, because mostly when you train a lacking body part more often, it gets worse due to it not being able to recover as good. So, um, I like to use the pre-exhaustion principle on lacking body parts. Like, for example, for my back, I start out with pullovers you know, Dorian Yates style and um, just put more focus and intensity on the specific body part you're trying to improve. Don't overthink it, just work hard. So I'll go by the mirror and I, when I see, when I, when, I, when I feel myself getting flat and losing pump, that's when I know I need a refeed once you get more experienced in your bodybuilding journey, you will know when you need to carve up or when you need to, you know, take a step back and diet a little less hard. But the main thing is you got to be honest to yourself and because um, there's a difference between needing a refeed, like your body really demanding it in order to um, sustain muscle and just craving a refeed, okay? Um, maybe a little chubby, but mostly for me what I'm, when I'm getting or losing definition, it's uh, water retention. And that just, you know, flows off me once I start dieting. The first two weeks I lose, I always lose at least 15 pounds, maybe 20 pounds when I'm really really fat. I know one off season before the Arnold Amateur that I did in 2013 I was really really chubby and I lost a lot of weight. Well my training style is I would say it is high volume I do train hard and I do train the failure, but it's a high volume training and I do train twice a day, which means um, I think it's called double splitting. Well, of course, the animal supplement and um, now I think it's just the combination of, you know, good metabolism, hard training, a lot of training. I also do some cardio in the off season, uh, 30 minutes, a couple times a week in the morning on an empty stomach because it just makes me feel better and I can train better with a little better um, cardiovascular health, especially when I train legs and everything, I don't get winded as much 
as when I haven't done it in the past. And also, I, I watch my eating. I'm very like um, meticulous with how much I eat and um, what I eat. <laughs> for breakfast, which is the pre-workout meal for my first session of the day, um, I have pancakes made with egg whites and I, I use a gluten-free gluten -free flour for that which consists of ground up corn and ground up rice. I also add some fruit to that like an apple or banana and um, that's basically it. So my post-workout meal and in my pre-workout meal during this off-season has been uh, breakfast that is 200 carbs from what I've just described and 75 grams of protein post-workout uh, I have basically the same thing again because it's easy and um, before my second workout of the day I always have either pasta or white rice with ground up uh, beef uh, lean ground up beef and that is again 100 to 125 grams of carbs from the rice or pasta and 75 grams of protein from the ground up beef. After that I have basically breakfast again.